Hi guys. Yeah, I've done it again. I've went over budget. My wife's not going to be very happy with me, I've got to say. We agreed on what we're going to spend on the boat if I was to put the lithium into the boat, change it all over, new batteries and such like. And uh, I ordered it all from the company I, I deal with here in Germany. It's called a Green Aku. <laughs> Unfortunately, when they phoned me and told me it was all ready, I just happened to look on their website and I noticed that they had the Polytech, uh, the Pylon Tech, 48 volts, 2.4 kilowatt, uh, US 2000C lithium ion batteries. Now I've got two, th two times um, the, the 2000B plus on my system and I found it wasn't quite enough if I didn't get sun for a few days. And they had them, I, I, I paid 1389 each of my batteries and they had this new one on offer for 820 euro. And I thought, I'm just going to add it. I, I just just add it onto the onto the bill, and I'll pick that up as well. So I've now got a new Palmatech. Um, I, ha I haven't actually told my wife yet, so I don't know how she's going to react to it. So this could be a bit funny. Anyway, uh, we're about to set off to pick them up, uh, to pick up all the gear, and she's the one's going to have to pay for it all sort of with the credit card. So we'll see how we go how we go on. Uh, what I have found out is that uh, the new uh, Pilotech, Pilotech um, 2000C has got a much better um, battery management system. So when you add that into your system, you've got to make sure that that one's the master battery and the other ones are tagged off of that. So when I get it back, I'm going to stick it onto the system and see how it goes. Uh, I'm quite excited. Uh, see see what we get we've had a few nice days quite a bit of sun lately so hopefully it'll bring my solar back up to what i really need and uh i'll show you i'll show you a link to the to the website web page i believe this is the cheapest pylon tech batteries on the internet at the moment i it's a very good deal so anyway, i just hope my wife doesn't hang me by something i'm not gonna like talk to you later Say hello, Yuta. We're now made it to Boswell. This is in Herrenfad. This is um, Heren, uh, it's very close to Venlo. It's about six kilometers or so from Venlo. This is where I buy the uh, solar gear for my uh, von Wagner and for the, the boat. Nice. It's a wee bit of a weird time at the moment because it's um, we're still in the lockdown and we've actually got to make an appointment for to come and pick this stuff up. They used to make a um, tiny house here. I don't think they do it anymore. So anyway, this is us here. And well, they've got all our stuff ready for us. It's all lying here. We just have to wait until someone comes for to to actually give it to us and take some money off of us. This is, uh, yeah. Everything that I asked for is, looks like it's here. The, um, <laughs> the MPPT it looks a lot bigger as I thought it would be. Never mind. Well guys, that was lucky today. I got a phone call to tell them that they, to tell me my stuff was ready for to pick up to take to Portugal for the boat, and I discovered that they had an offer on these. Now I have two fitted, the lithium 48 volt batteries. I have two fitted already, but the offer that I seen when I looked on the website was just too good to miss. So I thought, okay, I'll get another one and I'll stick that in with the other two. 
I have noticed my other two are 2000 pluses. This one says just 2000, but I don't, I think they're all compatible. So we'll soon find out anyway. The good thing about this is they also come with everything you need, even the bolts for mounting. So, uh, so I'm going to mount this up. Well, I've got to check the voltages are about in the right angle, the right area first. I've checked the one, the, the batteries it's in, and they're on 52 volts. So I have to make sure this is around about that area, otherwise I've got to plug them all together and leave them a little while. But anyway, I'll get back to you when I've got it mounted. Well, as you can see, I've got the new battery mounted. Unfortunately, it was 49.3 and my other batteries was 51.2 or so. So it's too big a gap between them. So I've connected them all up in series and switched them all on without anything coming out of them and without anything going into them. So now they should actually balance each other out. I prefer it to be balanced before I start putting charge into it so that they all charge up on the same rate. As you can see, this new one is actually taking the charge at the moment. And these two are just sitting fully charged. So I have to have, let's say I've just disconnected all of the cables. I'll put the links back in and and the main cable back in a little later on. So at the moment I'm running on mains <laughs> because my I've got to just wait until this balances. Once it balances, I'll connect it all back up again. And that'll, and that'll be it. Okay guys, well, I left them just connected together until they balanced out the, vo the voltages. It all worked well, relatively fast, to be honest. And then uh, Wired them all together. I obviously had to do. I didn't want to pull the top one back out again and to put the new uh, 2000C in top. So I just changed all the cables around so that it's now the bottom one is the master uh, battery. It's they're working really really well. I've never actually took any power from the grid for three days. Um, they've only ever been fully charged once because we haven't had a, an awful lot of sun lately. Um, but yeah, I think it's going to it's going to work a hell of a lot better. As we're going to really get a, a lot more from this now. The my wife's really been hammering them because she's been doing a lot of washing, a lot of tumble drying, uh, and I think she's quite happy that we bought it. So uh, I may get to keep a hold of my crown jewels for a little bit longer. Talk about crown jewels if you want to support us and help me hang on to my crown jewels. Um, there is a, my Patreon page. If you don't feel up to that, then the best way to support me, and it costs you nothing, is just leave a like, support my channel, click uh, subscribe. That really helps an awful lot with the channel. Uh, so if you click subscribe and like, and please leave a comment, tell me what you think. Anyway, that's that's all for now. Hopefully we'll be able to go to Portugal soon. Um, probably think it's, it's now going to be around about mid-June, July. Um when we get to Portugal and then we do start all over again with, with the boat. Anyway, I'll, I've got a few other wee things in mind, so um, <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll still keep posting videos. If you keep liking them, I'll keep posting them. Don't forget, guys, drop a like, subscribe. That's the best way. It's the cheapest way to support my channel. So all you got to do is uh, hit that subscribe button. It costs you nothing. Hit the like button if you liked it. If you don't like it, just a little thumb down. It works just the same. But uh, anyway, here's the next time. And I look forward to seeing you all back again. So take care of yourselves. Um, look after yourselves. And we'll hopefully see you soon. Bye.